God, but I didn't have a relationship. I believe it. And it's like, uh, it's, I wasn't ready to make that commitment. And it's a big commitment. You know? it's, so the sister goes, okay, well, I'll see you next week. She goes, okay. Well, next week came, she showed up, and I was like, oh, man, here comes this sister again. So then it was like, at this time, I was already tired. I had my bags of groceries, and she said, what's up, brother? You ready? And I was already broken. I mean, broken. Spiritually, and just, I mean, just broken. So she says, okay, well, let's do this. I said, let's do this. So then it's like, she said, I just let go of my groceries. I just put my hands out. And she just prayed over it. I accepted the Lord that day. And I mean, that same day, I got healed with the Holy Spirit. And I was just laid out. She laid out. I was like, wow. That's all it took. So it's like, you know, I kept, I kept going to church faithfully. And then all of a sudden, I got discouraged in some way. And then I stopped going to church. And then I ended up going back to church. And it was like, off and on things. So finally, it's just like, you know what? God's real. Uh, I know there's things that He can do, and I know what He wants me to do. So this, I just continue to start going back to church. I stopped going, and then a brother of mine introduced me. He said, Well, here's the church you can go to. I won't lead you, you know, I won't lead you in the wrong direction. So it's like, Go check them out. I've been there ever since the house of the house of the